What's up everybody, Will Lane, DreamChaserShow.com. Look, in today's video, I want to talk about something which, if you're going to be an entrepreneur, this is, this is going to be one of the, the key ingredients which is going to help you and take you to the next level, not just in your business, but also in life. And the idea is choosing your reaction to life. Choosing your reaction to life. Choosing how you respond to life's events. Okay, I'm going to share something with you guys, right? I lost my car today, right? My car got totaled completely. Freak accident. I'm okay. Thankfully, nobody got hurt. Everybody's okay. I just lost the car, right? It's pretty much total. And in the moment, you know, you're sitting there, you're looking at your car and it's mangled. So in the moment, you're like, goodness, how, you know, how did this happen? What's going on? But five minutes is all you get. After that, it's just kind of like, what's next? What do we have to do to you know, move on? We got to go car shopping. You know, let's talk to the insurance company, whatever the case may be. And you, know, you just got to move on with life. And your, your ability to create success in your life is going to be a direct function of how much pain, how much disappointment, how many setbacks you can accept and then continue to move anyway. You know, because a lot of people, they, they see, you know, these disappointments as a reason to stop. And then there's other people, there's a select few people who see disappointments and they draw energy for them, from them. And then they, they use that energy to move forward. They use it for motivation, right? So I got to make more money now, right? Because I got to go buy a car. You know, so it's always like you can always reframe anything. You know, you have life, right? Something happens. And then the thing that gets us in trouble a lot of times is we make a story about what happened, how awful it is, right? And then if it's awful, we're supposed to respond in a certain way. And it doesn't have to be like that. Life happens, something happens, you got your facts, and then the story is whatever you want to make it, right? You could have a setback and you could use that as a reason to say, okay, I got to step up big now. Life is trying to call me out here. Life is trying to call me out on the carpet. Right? <laughs> you, don't have to, you don't have to get upset. You don't have to, you know, ball up and, 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 and cry in the, uh, in the room with the shades down for a week. You know, move on. Stuff happens. Create your own story about whatever happens. But more than anything else, when you create that story, always make sure that you win. Look, I'm putting together a team of young entrepreneurs inspired to, you know, take over the world, work from anywhere, inspire people. If you like to do this, make sure you hit me up. I got some free training for you at the link below. Hopefully you learn something new or remember something you forgot. Till the next time we talk, live big, dream big. Peace.